Can we whatever you want, mate? Your so prophet, in the Bible, religion, God rested on the seventh day. I asked them, how did God rest? He's providing an interpretation based no, upon music. Based what upon music. Rest? Where did he get this from? It's not in the Bible. Rest? When Pastor, he asked, bro, bro, Pastor, 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 where is Pastor, it in the Quran? What do you do when you rest? What do you do when you rest? He's a fool. You stop. He's God rests. He's when God you rest, leads, you stop. He's God, God You're an killed. idiot. God's a bro, your God is Muhammad. A pagan stone kiss. He raped little kids. Don't worship. talk to he me about God. He worship Muhammad. His God died on a crucifix. And your God raped kids. A Roman, a Roman. Your God raped your God. Why are you he's shaking like yeah, a fool. I'm shaking because I'm electrocuted. Bro, calm down. Calm he's, down. Your, your I'm shaking because I'm electrocuted. What happened? Your God went on a crucifix. Your God went on a crucifix, right? And a Roman soldier got a spear. And your God Muhammad stepped on a child. He killed your God. Your God your Muhammad God got killed. with a child. Your God, got your God Muhammad stepped with a child. God if you, if you want to be vulgar and well, and not actually just what I'm saying, I'll just cuss out your God Muhammad. Your God got killed. And your God, your God, no, your God, God is killed. Muhammad. Your God got because killed. Muhammad was the only person who received revelations from a, a, a random God agent written in, in, in the Quran. And according to the Quran, hold on one minute, hold on one minute, according to the Quran, yeah? This guy received, no, according to what Hadith, this guy received revelations in a cave. Nobody witnessed it. Nobody witnessed this guy receive revelations in the cave. Waste of time. Check and make. It's a waste of time. It's a waste of time because you don't even know your own religion. It's so pathetic. It's the same guy who clearly you do, isn't it? Wait, in the Bible. Who was the guy who was the guy who in the Bible, it said Jesus fell on his face and prostrated. Who's he praying to if he was God? Who's he praying to? Yeah, if he's God himself, who's he praying to in the Bible? He was praying to his other form. Oh, he was praying to his father, he wasn't praying to his other form. So God was praying to God, yeah? We do not believe there's three forms of God. So wait, so who's he praying to if he's God himself? Who's he praying to? You, 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 you conclude, for no, one minute, you conclude that worship, worship that is sense, the same man. thing because that's what your books have told you. No. Because he is the God, father. Jesus they're, they're was there to talk to his God, father in heaven. At the same time. So he decided so you're to either pray You're either going to listen or you're not. But he's really matter. praying to himself. You can talk to yourself, so I don't really mind. You can ask me a question or you can talk to yourself. At the end of the and day. And that's Jesus what was in the Bible, isn't it? When he was talking to himself. Well, no, he was talking to himself. That's what he was praying to himself. He was God, right? Well, no, no, you don't understand the first thing in the Trinity. This is where you're wrong. There were three persons. Three different personalities, one Trinity. Okay, but who's praying to who? Who's praying to who? So Jesus was praying to God. To the Father. You're going to listen to me. You're going to keep the work I'm listening. All right, then. Basically, God being one person, because God being unique, and as I explained to you earlier, I'll actually show me what, how your God is one. You didn't show me that, but basically, yeah? God being one being, and three persons, those three persons have separate beings, right? So those three persons have the separate beings. One plus one, one plus one, 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 one or three. Is one plus one plus one, three or one? Mathematics. One times one times one. No, no, one, no, no, that? One, one times one plus one. One times one times one, No, not times, plus. One times one times one, what's that? One. I never said Please times. do not equate you your said stupid three in primary one. school maths to it's God. Three because one, if I right? say to you, how is God one, what are you going to tell me? Kulu Allah Ahad. God says it himself. He's oh, he one. says he's one. How is he one? He just says he's one. Father, no, no, how is he one? Father, Son, Holy Spirit. No, 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 hold on. How is your God one? I'm waiting for this answer. How is your God one? He says he's one. How is he one? You're saying he's one, but one what? One shoe, one dog, one, one cat. God. How is he one? One, that's it, it's simple. One what? what? One number then? It's one number. So your God is a number. If you don't know how your God is one, then please do not attack the Trinity because you don't understand basic triunity. One, it's just simple, it's, it's as simple as that. One but bro, you're one attacking the Trinity and you don't even know what the nature of being your God is. No, it doesn't make sense. But if you go to Quran, make sense. 4, 7, 1, 7, 1, what's he say? That Jesus is the word of Allah and the spirit of Allah. So what, what, is Allah without word? Is Allah without spirit? No, he has to have a word, he has to have the spirit. So that means that Jesus is the exact word and the exact spirit of Allah, according to your Quran. So that means that Jesus is... No, 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 it's our interpretation, it's what your Quran says. I've got the Quran right here. That's what it says. No, no, I understand the Quran more than you, because you don't even understand the plurality within your Quranic Godhead. You don't understand that. You've got a plurality, bro. You need to understand Even in the Surah 1960s to 90, bro, and you need to listen carefully. Surah 96 to 90, your Allah spirit, becomes a man, literally a body, embodied one of a man and says to Mary, I will give you a son. Where does it say that? Surah 19, 16 to 19. God says that he became a man, yeah? God said he became a man and literally... That's no, 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 sorry. You spread the lies. One minute, one minute, yeah? God, God's spirit, God's spirit becomes a man, right? And he says to Mary, well, I will give you... This is what you're talking about. He says to Mary, different, I will give you a child. 
It's all the same. Bro, read your own growing sources, bro. It literally says that. And don't go to Saudi and Dash because I know your translators literally hid in the Quran that was Angel. But if it was Angel Gabriel, ask me this how can Angel Gabriel comfort and subsist in Allah and then say to Mary, I will give you a child? That's, that's, that's problematic because that means that you're committing a shirt. Jesus died. Because then all translators are committing a shirt. Jesus died. Because, it, because if they're going to claim that Mary, literally, that, that, that Jabril, sorry, Jabril gave, gave Mary a son, then that's problematic. That means that Jabril creates life according to your Quran. So your allies are committing a shirt. You're just making up all this interpretation from yourself. Bro, I've told you the sources. Go and look them up. I've never heard anything you say. Because you haven't read your Quran. I have. I have. I do, I don't need to. Surah 1960 to 90. Surah 66, 12, and Surah 4, 171. Go and look them up. Literally, Allah's spirit and Allah's word is Jesus Christ, Kalimat Allah, and Ruhana. That is, no, 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 no. So what is it? Can't answer. You didn't answer my questions either. Can't answer. Bro, 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 you're ever going to answer it or not? You haven't asked, I've, I've showed you three sources, three different sources in the Quran. Christian He's not showing it. The in the Quran now this guy's changed the subject because he can't even answer it as well. How pathetic. No, <laughs> when, oh, I'm a retard. Look at this idiot smoking, bro. You you, you're crucifix. the same type of guy that criticizes the Holy Spirit. Yes, you smoke. Roman you know what got me to stop smoking, bro? God. You know what's got me to stop smoking? Who would you rather worship? Jesus, Jesus, the Holy Spirit. that killed God? Who's more powerful? The Jews claim that Jesus was actually hanged and stoned to Rather than crucified. Yeah, yeah. Right, well, you, do you know what, do you know what the crucifix right, so, about what is you know what, you know what the crucifix means? And it's more historical yeah. relevant yeah. that Jesus was do you know why? crucified on the cross than your, your Muhammad even existed. Do you know why the Jews wanted to so let's not. Do you know, answer my question. You know why? Instead of talking to me about your question, answer my question. Do you know why the Jews wanted to crucify why you, Jesus? Why are you asking questions and not answering what the crucifixion means? Curse. They want to curse him. Do you believe God was in cursed? In Surah 19, 16 to 19, according to the Quran, he believes Allah's that God was spirit cursed. becomes a man and says to Mary, I will give you a son. Now that's pop magic because yeah. that means that you believe your God Allah was is committing shirk and he's doomed to hell for it. Do you believe God was cursed? You're going to ask my question or not? Are you going to ask him? I'm waiting for you. I'm, I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting for you, I'm waiting for you bro, to ask you God was cursed. I'm waiting for you to answer the question. The cross means, the crucifixion means right, according cursed. to your Quran, to according to your Quran, to listen carefully. According to your Quran, Surah 19, 16 to 19, bro. Allah's spirit becomes a man and says to Mary, I will give you a son. Right? So I, written, son. No, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Allah's spirit, according to the Quran, has the power to give life. But according to the Quran, only Allah gives life. So that means Allah's spirit is co-equal with Allah and co-eternal with Allah. That means that's another God in the Islamic Godhead. Do you believe God was crucified? You're not getting what I'm saying. Do you believe God was crucified? You have two gods, bro. So far, two gods I've shown you. Okay. So are you, you going to address that point? Are you going to address that point? It's not about what I believe, it's what your book says. Are you going to address your point? Are you going to address that point? But you're not answering my point. You're not answering my point. So we're going to bring us up. So we're in a stalemate. Yeah. So what's fine talking? This is what I mean. The point is they don't listen because they don't want to listen. You don't want to listen. The reason why you don't want to listen, you don't want to listen is because you understand how embarrassing your Godhead is. Your God is embarrassing to you. Because you realise there's a plurality within your Islamic Godhead. You realise that and now you have to atone for it. So, you, you so instead of tapping the Trinity, in fact, look into your own Quran. Look up, look, look up the definitions of what's in your Quran. You, you'll quickly find out. You believe God was crucified. So you believe God was cursed, right? The Jews cursed God, right? Why did you say such a thing, sir? That's what Change the crucifixion means. The topic of the so conversation. What is the reference that's what it means. Curse. What is the reference for that? What's the reference for that? Bro? That's what Jews believe. That's what's what the reference, reference for sir, it? Bro? No, Just show us sir, the sir, what the Quran means. I gave you references. I gave you surahs. You showed me nothing. Show me nothing. Show me the references. Brother, can I, can I just point out, have you noticed how much silent he was regarding answering your basic questions? Yes, he's not answering our basic questions. But suddenly he became a spokesperson. Yeah, a spokesperson for the Bible. It's like he knows the Bible. When it comes to his Quran, he's silent. Nobody knows the Bible, man. You don't know the Bible. What is the Bible? There's like 50 copies of it, man. 50 no, copies? <laughs> so he goes to the Sheikh Google to figure out. Oh, Sheikh Google. Hey, Sheikh Google, please be upon him, huh? Yalla. So give us the biblical reference that crucifixion means curse. Well, we're going to be here for a while because Shake Google, peace be upon him. Take a seat. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, coffee, welcome. Hello, coffee, huh?
You worship a man. You worship the black stone. You worship a man. No one worships. You kiss the black stone, bro. No one worships a black stone. You find me in the Quran. Find me one verse in the Quran where it says to worship the black stone. It's too much information for me to do that. Oh, it's too much information. Oh, so you know about the Bible, huh? Halash, you do not know nothing. It's all about Halash, you're one of the unbelievers, huh? You made the cross. It means curse. That's what the Jews. Where's the reference, bro? Where's the reference? I want to know where the cross is meant literal, like right? curse. Where's the cross mean? I, I find the Sabbath amazing. So I'm going to ask you a very basic question about your core doctrine, yet you did tap dancing and walked around and you failed to answer that basic question. Because he can't answer But you depend on Sheikh Google to answer Hatun, he cannot answer it. He, no, no Muslim can. But they don't realize they've got a plurality within the Godhead, yet they attack the Trinity. But have you noticed? Really. When the questions you ask him regarding the deity of the spirit in the Quran, Sheikh Gogol was not available. Oh, yeah, Sheikh Suddenly Gogol. Sheikh Gogol becomes Sorry, available. Read it. Sir, give me the That's key, my give reference, me the reference there. What is that reference? Is that that's what it says. Oh, that's from Ryan Sheikh Gogol. That's Sheikh Gogol. So give me proper Sheikh reference. Google. Okay. Where's, Sheikh the, where's the Bible, bro? Show me the Bible. In the Bible. In the Bible. No, don't, don't give me. Don't give me. In the Bible. Bro. Show me in the Bible. One of the things you can't tell me where Muhammad says that. Where Muhammad says that. I'm sure if crucifixion means curse, yeah, does. Muhammad mentioned that in somewhere. Muhammad is the best example and last example. So why didn't the sure Jews just kill Jesus? Why did they? Why did they? Why did they crucify him? Why didn't they just kill him? So you don't know the Changing answer. Changing the goalpost again. No, no. You don't know yes, the answer. I know the answer. I know the answer. But they they crucified him so people would disbelieve him. Sorry, where did they, they didn't crucify want to just kill him. They wanted to kill his message. Where did they crucify him? I just told you. Where? Give me reference. Uh, I just told you. You don't have a reference, do you? You do not have a reference. This is funny. This, this is hilarious. Bro, brother, this is hilarious. You are the funniest Muslim I've ever met, bro. You are a funny man, bro. You are a funny man. Where's the reference? You're not happy with Google. 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 No, don't look at the Bible, bro. I went to your Quran. I went, no, no, one minute, one minute. One. I went to your Quran and I showed you. Surah 96 to 90. I showed you from your Quran. I showed you. Let, let her get the Quran. She'll get the Quran and I'll show, I'll, show, I'll show you exactly what I mean by that. Surah 96 to 90, Surah 66 to 12, and Surah 4, 107 to 12. It's a well-known thing that the crucifixion means curse. It's a curse. They wanted to curse him. Right, you believe that way in the Bible it says. I'm not going to show you. I tried to show you, you didn't accept it. So you go find out yourself, bro. Yeah, show, show me where in the Quran it says. Show, show me where in the Bible it says. Oh, so I have to go find out myself. Oh, the hypocrisy. But you don't even know your own religion because you, because when I mentioned Surah 96 and 90, you knew nothing. You worship three in one. How is that good one? Huh? How's your good one? He's one, that's it. One what? One what? One what? One what? You don't even know what that one is. <laughs> There's the Quran, look it up yourself. Surah 19, 16 to 19. Go to Surah 96. Are you afraid of your Quran? He's afraid of it, it's a curse. It's a curse, huh? He's afraid of Allah. I've got a Quran in here if you want to look in that as well. So here's the crown for you to answer very basic questions, brother. Ask. I've answered your mind. Bro, I, you kept asking the whole references. time. I showed you the whole reference. time we've been talking. I showed you a reference. All you've done you accept is accept the reference. Ignore my questions. Is it the same thing? And then make up excuses. The same thing. You don't understand your God. You don't understand the proclivities of your own, the own triunity within your own Godhead. But soon you'll realize. Trust me, inshallah. Huh? I worship one God. You worship three. What? How is that God one? Huh? How is your God one? It does matter, relevant, bro. Relevant. <laughs> one word. One word. You worship three gods. You believe you believe Jesus was cursed. How do you measure that one? You believe that Jesus was praying to himself. How do you measure that one? Huh? How do you measure that one? One, that's it. How do you one measure what? the one that you, you believe? But that's how that's one plus one. Do you not see the inconsistencies? Do you not see the inconsistencies? Because a little child will tell you the same thing. Do you not see but if a little child will say to you, how is your God one? And you can't answer that. So you can see the inconsistencies. But you try and make that as one. Who said I believe in three gods? You did. When did I say that? The Trinity. The father and the son, right? That's free. Right? You believe that, right? Being. You believe that, right? It's one being. It's one being. But it's free, though. I never said free gods. He's lying again, committing to form. Can you show from Christian scripture that he believes in three gods? He said it himself. I'm not going to do that. He said it himself. I never said free gods. You believe in the Trinity, right? Hey, we rewind this back here. Yeah, did I say free gods? Never said free gods. Did I say free gods? Never said free gods. So you don't believe in the Trinity? I don't believe in free gods. You believe in the Trinity? 
You believe in the Trinity? Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Why? Yes or no? Why? When we first, no? when we first, no, 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 listen. When we first, listen to me. You're going to be quiet. You're going to ask my question. You're going to be quiet. Are you going to ask my question? You're going to be quiet. Answer my question and I'll be quiet. You're going to be quiet. When you ask my question, I'll answer your question. You're going to be quiet. I've given you so many opportunities to answer the question, but you don't want to answer it. You believe in the Trinity? Yes or no? Right, in order to explain this to you fully, I need to understand what God Look, is. very pedantic right now. It's a simple question. Right? Yes so or no? So answer this Three question or one. first, then I'll ask you a question about Trinity. How is your God one? Okay. That's all I need to know. Question, I'm ask yours. That's all I need to know. Answer my question first. In order to answer your question, I need to understand how your God is one. If you don't understand your God, you cannot comment on the Christian God at all. You have to bunch yourself. I'm saying Arabic. Why are you saying Arabic? I'm not Arabic, bro. No, but the Quran is okay. re was revealed in Arabic. I understand the language. How you, how you oh, so you're translated, translated to the horizon. You're translated to the horizon. And they've just written a false book. It's not the same. When you read it in Arabic, it's not the same. Oh, oh it's, not it's a hidden meaning, English huh? A it's a language. hidden meaning. English is an inferior language compared to Arabic. Yeah? Mm. English is a very. Uh, it's Arabic always is a very rich language. It's, it's deep, always that excuse, meaning. bro. It's deeper meaning. Your translators, yeah. even with Yusuf Ali, say that they've translated it perfectly. He's so have their line or your line. And you have never wrote a book in your life, I can tell you that now. It's the problem with English language. You've never written a book in your life, I can tell that. But who are you talking to? You don't even know. Are you still afraid of looking at your references for another Very, I'm terrified. Did you want to look for the rest for 1960? Huh? Do you want to look for the rest of my question? Do you want to look for the rest of One of my questions, not even all of them, just one. Bro, I've asked one. a question from, from day dot. This is when I was literally signing, I asked you one question, you didn't answer it. You just said, oh, well, how is your, how is your trinity? And it's like, no, answer this one question. It's so 1960 to 90. Do you believe in one, one or three? It's so 1960 to One or three? To or three and one. God, what is it? Spirit becomes a man, literally, yeah, literally becomes a man and says to Mary, I will give you a son. Is that, is that Allah or is it not? A yeah, it becomes a perfect man. So that's the, that, that according to God, God, God has sex God. with Mary, and that's how Jesus came. Where does it say God? Says begotten. That's what begotten means. If you look at the definition right, of Surah begotten, 66, it means it's somebody physically. It's Surah sixty-six twelve. That's what begotten means. Surah sixty-six twelve. Yeah. When Allah blew into Mary's vagina, which her vagina, was he having sex with Mary? Begotten. Look at the definition of begotten. No, no, no. It's Surah sixty-six twelve. According to your Quran, Allah blew his spirit. Allah blew his spirit into Mary. Was that sexual? Was that sexual? Was it sexual? When Allah blew his spirit into Mary. It According to your Quran, okay. was it sexual? Bro? Say that again. When Allah blew, this is what I mean. You're not listening. Bro. Try I'm listening. listening now, I'll ask you, bro. Yeah. In Surah 66:12, when Allah blew His spirit into Mary's vagina, was it sexual? Yes or no? Vagina. That's what your sources say. Was it saying vagina? It says vagina. Yeah. According, saying according saying. to lexical sources, it says vagina. Bro. We're just trying to be. Uh, Oh, I'm just trying to be a friend. Look I'm, up your I'm own sources, bro. I've suspected your religion like you have. Mate, mate, you're, 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 you're disrespecting you're your own religion right now no, no, no. because you're saying he doesn't say you that. So God. Allah's words are wrong, are they? You God impregnated the woman. That's what begotten means, you know that. Right, and in Surah 66, 12, as I've explained, when, 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 when God blew his spirit into Mary's vagina, was that sexual or not? That never happened. You, 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 so, so it didn't happen to all because his Quran's a lie then. It never happened because your Quran is just a lie. Okay, what are you then? saying? You just found Allah under the bus. You just found Allah under the bus. Well done. You're one of the Kufar. Okay, I'm spraying lies. So, Surah 66 of the We are in the middle of a pandemic. Oh, shut the hell up. Sir, is your Quran is lying? He's lying. I never said that. So, so no, said it. <laughs> no, what, vagina? Where does it say vagina? Show me where it says vagina. And I'll become Christian right now. It says Fajr according to Lexus huh? sources. It says Fajr according to Lexus sources. According to Arabic, it says Fajr. Yeah. Arabic Lexus sources, it says Fajr according to that. That is, a, that is a me saying. God impregnated the woman. You believe God died. I you believe God was cursed. You. you believe God this is free. Mean, you're not listening. All your beliefs. God you're not killed. listening. God was killed everything, bro. God you watch out. Yeah. It's <laughs> so back with their religions. They don't even understand. But based on my religion, so they want to impose so their own. I've asked you, how is God one? You haven't explained that baby step religion. Baby step. Bro. I've just said, how is God one? How is God one? You've not explained that at all. I've talked about Surah 960 to 90, showing this plurality with your Godhead. You haven't answered that. So, uh, why your God is one? One in what way? If you can't answer that, then you're then you're then you're being illogical. Then you're being unreasonable. And you're, just, you're just admitting how stupid you are. So talk about what my God did and what it didn't do. Relevant. Your God did a lot of ridiculous things. At least I have one God. You have like three in one. Where did I say I have three gods, bro? Trinity. That's the that's the principle. That's not the Trinity. The Trinity is one being in three persons. You don't understand basic English. So a hybrid God, yeah. 
A hybrid god? Yeah. You've not explained to me how your god is one. You don't even know what a god is. I don't know what your god is, bro. No, you don't know what a god. You don't even know your own god. No, no, you think you do? But, but no, how's your how's your god one? Explain to me that question. No, no, Colossus, Colossus. Habibi, explain to me that as one. Explain to me as one. Explain to me how that's one god. How's that? How's your god one? How's your god one? How's your god one? How's your god one? We're at stalemate, and the reason why we're at stalemate is because you want you don't want to answer the question because you're scared you though. because you don't know you? you don't know you're good but you attack you other people's yeah. goods. I'm not attacking no one. Yeah. So I'm attacking your beliefs though. It's thing Definitely attacking your beliefs. Because because you. Because you. I believe. Well, oh, you can't I attack my beliefs because God. your beliefs are not. I believe in the same. I believe in the same God that Jesus believed. No, no, no. Your beliefs inconsistent. Who was Jesus praying? Who was Jesus praying? To the father. Himself, himself, himself. To the father. Himself. Jesus. Right, 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 right. Who knows everything? Are you going to ask my question? I want, no, no, I want to ask you. I want to ask you. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, and you're going to ask my question. I see him. If you're going to answer his question first. Are you going to ask my question? You don't want to ask me. No, I'm, I'm sorry, because in order to understand how God is one, you've got to understand how God works. Jesus is your own God. You cannot complain about how God works according to the Bible. You do not know how your God is one. So don't complain about how the truth works because you don't understand that. Jesus submitted himself to God. God. He frustrated himself. I'm yeah? asking you one question. I need you to answer it. How? how is your God one? Go Simple. How is your three? Yeah. <laughs> how is your three? And became a child. How? How is this? This is what I mean. The stupid thing of is gone. They cannot answer their question. They cannot answer one question. Okay. And the reason why they can't is because they know for a fact they do not know their God to impose such things on them. I've shown them that there's plurality within the Godhead according to the Quran. So in 19, 16 to 19 says that Allah's no, spirit, no, no, no. Allah's no, spirit, no, no, no. which transcends from him becomes a man and it says to to no, to mary sorry that i will give you a son so that shows that allah's spirit can give mary a son which means he's a life giver according to your quran two gods and then according to quran that the quran spirit. itself that sorry spirit. according to quran the quran itself is eternal that spirit, three gods that same because spirit, eternality that same, eternity is only something that god's same spirit is what gave so, life to adam according to your quran there's three okay. gods bro yeah, but that spirit is not the same spirit as what you believe. So what is it then? You believe that spirit to be... Right, right, so what is that spirit then? It's the same spirit that gave human beings life. All human, all human life. Right, life. so it's the Holy Spirit, right? Not the Holy Spirit, what you believe, no. So it would have, to, it would have had to exist before, before creation, right? Yeah. So it's uncreated, right? Yeah. That means that the priority within the Islamic God is. Because that means that you're committed shirt right now because you claim that there's two people who can give life called the Quran. That means there's two gods in the Quran according to your ideology right now. Explain, explain, explain. What is there to explain? Bro? You've just said that that's Allah's spirit, right? Yeah. You said it was eternal, right? Yeah. So if it's eternal, that means that it's separate from Allah because it says We're to eternal it. eternal as well. Our souls are eternal. Not necessarily, no. Yeah. When we die, our souls live. Right, so your, your souls like Allah then? Your souls like Allah? So your, your soul eternal like Allah? It's given from Allah. It was given from God. Right, but your soul is eternal like Allah. It's eternal. Never said it's like is Allah. Is it eternal like, like Allah? You can't say like Allah. But it's, it's the thing, you you're, not, you're, like it's the thing you're forgetting. We're not like God. We're not like God. Eternal you can't compare us to God. implies that there is no end. Yes. Right? Yes. So if there's no end to his eternity, that means that he is God. And no right? beginning. It would have to be God. And no beginning. And no beginning. Right? Yeah. We, we no have a beginning. beginning. We have a beginning. Exactly. We have a beginning. That's the point I'm trying to make you understand. God has no beginning. Right. God has no beginning. Yeah, exactly. That means his spirit has no beginning. Right? His spirit has no beginning. His word has no beginning. And I've just shown you the human spirit soul. becomes a perfect man according to Quran 90, 16 to 19. Yeah? And says to, to Mary, I will give you a son. How much more do you not how much more information do you need to not understand that that's a separate God that is part of our law? How, how much more information do you need? That's a separate person in your Islamic God. And you cannot accept <laughs> You can't accept the fact that your God is superiority. You can't even accept that the fact that you don't even know how your God is one. You your God died. You, do, you cannot even tell me how you're going to die, did it? But this is the thing, what? the basics, even the most basic questions when you died, avoid. When you believe God died, he had enough. Yeah, yeah. But it is the thing. Who's, this is very primary school crap. Who's running the world? Because Who's you can't after actually us? understand how you're going to You want to impose a kind of theology on my own God. First, work out your God is one, then come back to me. Is that okay? Likewise, man. You go get some shots. Is that short of the chat man? What's your name? I'm the captain, bro. You're what? I'm the captain. The captain of what? Is that your nickname? Mm. Have a nice day, bro.
not really prepared. But you're a Christian, bring out the verse. Oh, okay, Did you not read the Bible? Show us the hadith. Does God regret? Yes or no? Show us the hadith. Wait, leave it. For us the hadith. Show us the hadith. Leave it. Now, bro, leave it. I'm not interested in talking to you. Okay, you said you said God has such a truth. You said you said God has such a truth. You said you said God has such a truth. You said you said God has such a truth. You said you said God has such a truth. You had a claim, your God you regrets, have no evidence, bro. we your break God and you're running away. Your God regrets, bro. Okay. Your God regrets. Take have you read the book? Whatever. Have you read the Bible? I've read that. Have you? God regrets. You've read, you read the Bible? At, take that on the chin, your God so regrets. If I read Harry Potter, do I know the whole context bro, of Harry Potter? Take that on the chin, your God regrets. Okay. Take on the chin. I take it on the chin that you have no good and you have no reason for objective morality. So you think about morality. It's kind of hypocritical. And he's all perfect. But God regrets. I saw Ronald. I saw Sadiq. You have no good. Don't go away. Show Sadiq. You said something and you don't have a proof. Yo bro, take it on the chin. Your God regrets. That's what you might do it. He said, he said, where's the Quran? He said it's in the Hadith. And we'll ask you to show us the Hadith. And then take it on the chin that your God regrets as well. Take on the chin. Take on the chin. You're still talking about Your God regrets. Have you read the Bible? But your God regrets. Have you read the Bible? Take on the chin. How about you read the Bible? First, how about that? Take on the chin. Oh, you're God regrets. <laughs> Finish. Your God regrets, man. Just take on the chin. Stop looking at other religions when your God regrets. What's the point of looking at other religions? Your God regrets, bro. Have you got an answer to that? Of course not. You just follow blindly like a sheep. You're still talking. I'm telling just you. The truth. Blah, 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 blah. But you're listening to it because you have no answer. Because you have no answer. Are you still talking? And you've got no answer. Boring. God regrets in Samuel 15, 11. You can search that up yourself. Like, why are you telling him? He's a Christian, he should know his Bible. He should know that his God regrets. No, I don't know why you're talking about my God regretting. That has nothing to do with the conversation. No, but you're the right, you're right. It has nothing to do with the conversation. So you, you, when we were talking to you about it, you started that first. So you can't um, get onto him. You can't get onto him. No, but I, that, that was my question from before. Exactly. All right, this is said, it. This is it. Now it's the eye shot. So this is Sayu al Bukhari. You can look on it. Book of Wedlock, Marriage in the Castle. So look. Narrated Aisha that the prophet married her when she was six years old. Where does it go? And he consummated his marriage when she was nine years old. Where's the God? Where's your God? prophet, you said your God, you God, said... your God, God, Muhammad, not... has Muhammad, sex Muhammad isn't with God. a child. You're shouting, so you're right. Yeah, that's who you're shouting. I'm shouting, so I'm right. Well, that's your hadith. Well, your hadith's wrong. Hello, your hadith's wrong. No, you said God. No, 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 no. You said God. You said your hadith. You said your God. You said God. Where's your God? Your prophet. Where's your prophet? Your God. No, don't. Listen. How old was Joseph? 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 Your we know who your God is! is. We know who your God is! Your God is Muhammad! Psycho, bro. Oh, look at you. Your God is Muhammad, bro. You're finished, that. Uh, I'm finished, Aki. Like how, how old was Joseph when he married Mary? Huh? Shut up. 19. <laughs> Leave it. Leave how, it. How, old is, how, old, Leave how old is Mary it. It. when your God has sex with her? It's, it's blue notes into her fajr It's our God. It's our God. Yes, it was your God. Where is it set up? Bring it. Go on, 6 6 12. Go and look up your phones. Okay, we will. No, no, go and look up your phones. Okay. Well, you Quran, do the work. Quran, I, I got the work. Quran, Quran, I got the work. You do the work. Hey, Quran, what? Tell, tell me. 66 12, bro. Surah 66 12. Surah 66 12. Surah 66 12. We're going to look at it right now. And if you're wrong, I want to apologize because you're lying. I'm not apologizing you for anything. Uh, I say arrogant. Uh, I so want to apologize for you for something that I'm not lying about. CC6. Arabic says for We just told you if you should. What about Arabic says for Arabic? Oh, So you're just wrong. Shout, that's it. Then why are you talking to me, bro? You lot came to me. Make me shot. 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 This is 66 12. This is 66 12. And the example of Mary, the daughter of Imran, who guarded her chastity, so we blew into her. We blew into her. We blew into her through our angel, and she believed in the words of her Lord. Why that? That's an agitation. Ruhana. Ruhana. We blew into her our spirit, bro. Look on the pickle version as well. Because that's an honest translation. The honest translation says pickle. Pickle is your honest translation. So it says that. We blew, we blew into, into our, our garment through our angel. He's right. basically saying we impregnated her without her having sex. Garment, right? For Jahar is the literal translation. But, but your translators Word have decided to hide that Word away from the translation. No, no, no. Okay, wait, Look at you you yourself. I'm not doing your work for you. I, I, okay, okay, so okay, okay, read okay, your own books. No, no, study your own Arabic. Allah! Allah has sex with a six-year-old Aisha. Words say Aisha in his verse. Bring me what Aisha says in his verse. You said Allah has sex with Aisha when she was six. Words say Aisha at two in his verse. Do you see Aisha? Or are you lying? I showed you the hadith where you literally your prophet had sex with Muhammad. When she, when she was nine years old. When she was nine years old. 
Oh, bro. Oh, no, you, you're you profane right now because you have a sex with oh, no, 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 I, I, I'm not having sex with truth, am I? I'm not playing a game with children, bro. This guy said you're I want drugs, am I? Okay, then. You've got nothing. You can't even defend your prophet. Wow. You said, you said, oh, God has sex with a six year old and still a Quran. You said, we're in the Quran. You bought a hadith. You bought a hadith and he said, Muhammad has sex with Aisha. They said, it's in the Quran. No, I said clearly that Muhammad has sex with a nine year old girl. Did he say God or Muhammad? He said God. Oh, they're not boys. They're not boys. They're just over Mohammedans. They wouldn't be biased at all. Wow, this conversation is done. Right, right, right. He's right, right. He's right. He's right. This conversation is done. I've had snow police people in the sky. He's been Halas. 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 You have been finished. Finish. Walla. Halas. 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 Yeah. I don't know what that conversation was about. First, they were talking about um, Jesus being coming from Mary and her breasts. Then it divulged into them saying to me, oh, show me a hadith where Muhammad had sex with a nine-year-old girl. And I've showed them the hadith and they've decided to cry about it. Seems like the Muslims don't know what they're doing.